And already we have some news that's coming in, some of which are making rounds on social media, and we have to validate this. News coming in from uh, the Asawasi constituency, current member of parliament there being uh, Honorable Muntaka Mohammed. There are some reports making rounds uh, that he has, you know, allowed his six-year-old daughter uh, to vote uh, or almost, you know, endorse a candidate on the ballot. And this looks very worrying if it is the case that, you know, this happened. But first of all, we have to establish whether this happened or not. And I'll be speaking to uh, Shanti Regional Correspondent who uh, has a lot of information on this. He has been investigating this one on the ground. His name is William Evans Zinkum. We have Evans Zinkum on the line. Hello, Evans. Hello, Evans. Hello, um, Evans. Right, Evans, uh, so this development regarding the Asawasi Member of Parliament, uh, uh, Honorable Muntaka Mohammed, are you able to provide us some updates on exactly what has transpired? Well, so, Stephen, Muntaka came to the polling station with his daughter, and he, he went through the process with his daughter. But when, we, when he got to the booth where he was supposed to cast um, that secret ballot in, he, two hands moved into the booth. But at this stage, it is very, very difficult because there's no evidence showing that Muntaka actually held the hands of his daughter to campaign on a particular candidate. That hasn't been established. The only thing that we know is that two hands moved into the booth and we are unable to establish as to which of the hands, that is, as to whether it was Muntaka's hand that can print it or a daughter. But for now, there's no substantiated evidence to prove that Muntaka's daughter, it was Muntaka's daughter's hands that was tamprinted or his hands that was tamprinted. Well, thank you very much for that update, uh, William Evans. William Evan Zinkum, um, this is exactly what we wanted to get to the bottom of because he's a member of parliament and ostensibly he will appreciate what the rules of engagement uh, really are. Well, viewers, there you have it. Uh, that uh, appears uh, currently we don't have any evidence to suggest that, you know, the honorable member of parliament for the Aswazi uh, constituency uh, has allowed his daughter uh, to sort of uh, uh, thumbprint the, the ballot paper as far as the elections is concerned. Well, so if, if you can, if you are watching us, you can see uh, a video of exactly what transpired uh, at, the, at the constituency and at the polling booth when uh, the Honorable Member of Parliament uh, got uh, to the polling station. There you can see himself uh, washing his hands, COVID-19 protocols, uh, very, very important. And you can see his daughter as well, uh, washing, washing uh, her hands as well. And that is what we want to see. Question is, um, did the daughter at any point uh, in this process uh, thumbprint, you know, the the ballot paper for the member of parliament it's important that we understand these facts so we don't mar the the elections as as we speak and uh you can see the video rolling up now you have the member of parliament clad in white um in a queue waiting for his turn uh to to take his ballot paper and vote and at this point it doesn't appear that the daughter uh, of the member of parliament honorable muntaka mohammed for the asawasi asawasi constituency uh, allowed his daughter to thumbprint um, the ballot paper uh, for him.